and welcome back to LCA TV. It is still the morning of day one. My name is James Bromberger. With me on the couch as always is Mr. Michael Davies. Good morning. And we're joined right now by John O'Oxer. Hey. John, good morning. How are you? Very good. How's LCA going for you so far? Fantastic. Welcome back again. You've been to a whole bunch of these now, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. I've been to every one since 2002. 2002? That's, I think that's almost a record. I think maybe only Rusty might eclipse that. Yeah. Possibly. Uh, the few, I, think I think we're down to yeah. Steve Hanley. Steve Hanley? Yeah. There's a very few number. That there's a very few number. We have a few ones. No. What keeps bringing you along this conference? I don't want to ever get to the point where I have to say, no, sorry, I missed that one. Yes. Yeah, I need to continue. You've set yourself up now. It's going to be a harder and harder bar to do. But have you ever run one? Sorry? Have you ever run an LCA? No, no, no. <laughs> There's always a first time. No, I hadn't thought of that. Yeah, no, I hadn't thought of that. I think you do really well. But you have been running the mini comps, haven't you, for a couple of years? Actually, for the Melbourne um, LCA, it was when I originally raised the idea of doing that. And that was about the time that I ended up on the Hardy Mini. Yes. So I set aside my organization. So you set it up and you make someone else's problem to do it. Is that how it goes? I really just raised the idea. <laughs> oh, that's how I feel at this conference this year. I don't have to do anything except I'm kind of doing a little bit here and there, but it's great to see so much happening. Now look, um, you brought along a piece of hardware. What can you tell us about it? Black box.
<laughs> Lots to take things apart, Absolutely. see how they work, and improve them. Try and put them together again. And fix the bugs. Yes. You know? yes. So uh, this is the perfect example. I mean, with the radios, I think that's an interesting piece, though. There are certain pieces which we can't open. Yes. That's the GSM modem, is it? Right. It doesn't incorporate the audio circuit or the antenna or things like that. Part of the reason for this is that we need um, certification. Because basically, that module is a software for a radio. So, in previous days, years ago, radios were all hard to play electronics. They weren't doing anything other than electronics. That's right. Well, that is what times. Yeah, that is what times. Radios moved into the So what about going between different regions of the world where you've got different uh, bandwidths that are reserved for mobile phone networks? Is it just a new firmware with the same hardware?
Wow. Tech for a second and, and actually ask you about your talk. You're doing a talk here about, I believe it's uh, changing firmwares in orbit. Yes, that's right. You've been playing in the space industry for a little bit. Again, I believe with Arduinos. Yes, that's right. Tell us a bit about that. Yes. I have none myself. No. Uh, really? No. So when did you actually have that launch? It's about two months ago, was it?
how, do you know how many experiments have been done since it's been up there? What's the lifespan supposed to be? Of, oh, have you got an idea of how long you're expecting it to last? Probably around six months or so. Right. Satellites are deployed into orbit generally they are all going to decay over time. And how fast it goes depends on how well the orbit is set up and the altitude and things like that. These particular satellites, um, again, around, I think it's more than 20 kilometers altitude, just about that 50 international space station, I would say, varies a lot from where it's been recently. Look, John, I'm going to say thank you ever so much for joining us on the couch. I'm really interested in everything you've been working on. Um, I'm hoping to make it into your talk. We've got a whole bunch of talks about to start up now. Um, Vert.io, we've got uh, uh, Monitoring Without Limits, Android. Uh, I'm assuming you may be interested in the Android one coming up. Is that, is that your pick for the next piece? Um, System Administration in the Open and Past, Present and Future of MySQL Invariance by Stuart Smith. So um, a lot of great content to kick off the content. It's nearly uh, 10.30 now, so that all kicks off in 10 minutes. So It's an exciting day. It's, it's all go here. It is. Enjoy the conference. Enjoy the conference. And, uh, yeah. It is, isn't it? These are our presents. Is, the, is that the time to be in our presence? Uh, um, well, that's a bad time. Well, thank you ever so much for joining us, and I'll, I'll catch you around. Thank you very much. Thank you, John. Cheers. Bye-bye. We'll see you soon.